It's a mesmerizing sight at Lake Berryessa. This is the Morning Glory Spillway, or as it is often called, the Glory Hole. You know, my guess is because there's a big hole, <laughs> and so people have chosen to utilize other terms, but the official term is Morning Glory Spillway. This watery vortex may look like a part of science fiction, but it is really just a big drain for the Monticello Dam. When the lake level rises above 440 feet, water starts spilling into the hole. It's all curved, so you have the least resistance for the water to go down the glory hole. And it's, it's very efficient, There's not, it's not very turbulent, it's actually rather, rather placid. It's not that placid down inside the, the glory hole itself. The water drops 200 feet straight down before making a hard turn and spilling out into the Puda Creek below. Why the unusual spillway? Well, you're in a canyon. As you can see behind us here, that's the other side of the canyon. We didn't have room to build a big channel and an overflow uh, berm like at Oroville. Big, wide, flat area, that's not here. This is the Devil's Gate in the canyon. Engineers also took advantage of a tunnel they had already built to divert Puda Creek during construction of the Monticello Dam. And that's the outlet of the tunnel they drilled to divert Puda Creek around the dam site when they were building it. Ah. And then when they were done building the dam, they needed a spillway. So they went over to where the glory hole spillway is and they tunneled straight down and tied in to the tunnel that had gone around the dam and then blocked up the upstream portion of it so that when the lake filled, it would spill down the spillway, makes a hard right downstream, and that's what we see coming out down here. It's hard to say just how long the glory hole will keep spilling, but it could be several more weeks or even months. It always depends on the watershed, the upper watershed, um, how much water we're going to see come through here, but it could be a few months, it could be a couple of months. Uh, in 2017 we had similar precipitation, and it, I mean, we started in February and we went through May um, with, with spilling. So, I mean, it very likely could be that case this year again. <laughs>